You're gonna try to kill me ag again? What? 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 It hurts so much. Davy. You tried to kill her? Ah! Woo! How's it going everyone? My name is Swingpoint and this is another episode of The Crooked Man. In this episode, a lot of things really start to come together as to why we have met Sissy, why we have met Dee, and why we have met Fluffy. And Paul is a big part of figuring out why we do that. You guys will get to see what I'm talking about in the middle of this episode, so sit back, relax, and enjoy. I hope I didn't shoot him. Fluffy, what's wrong? Were you hurt? I hope I didn't shoot him. Fluffy? Don't pass out, Fluffy! Fluffy! Fluffy, why? Why what? What what? Huh? No. I... It's so scary, but I keep hanging in there, and I just want to go home. So why won't Mama come? Does Mama hate me? It's fluffy, Fluffy, Fluffy. Fluffy, don't, don't run away. Please don't run away. I hate chasing you. Mama hates me, so she'll never come back for me. Maybe this is talking about how David's mom isn't coming back to who she wants. Do you know what I mean? Because David's mom, his brain is gone. And she's not going to be her anymore. She's not going to come back to David. She's. Do you get what I'm saying? Do you get what I'm saying? Fluffy, it's not true. You're not unwanted. It's It's not. It's. Whoa, what was that? That was a mommy. That was a mommy. That, that's not. You. You. I'm going to Mr. Policeman. Huh? Well, okay, but I'll go with you. I'm fine! I can go there by myself! See, none of these people want to be accompanied. Fluffy, you shouldn't go alone late at night. I'm a tough kid. I can make it on my own. Even if Mama isn't there. Even if Mama isn't there, I won't cry. Wait! Wait! Oh, ah! Oh, a demon in my head! Your head! My head! Oh, God, why are you getting- Ow! Freaking David! Oh, my head, it feels like it's gonna explode. And now we're gonna have a flashback. You know? Fluffy? 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 Oh, he left? On his own? Really? Fluffy? No, Fluffy! Your mother didn't hate you. Fluffy? Uh-oh. It was you who lost faith in her. Call that! See, he lost faith in his mom. Ha 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 ha! Call that! Call that! What have I been doing here? You've been chasing yourself, David. You've been trying to figure out who you are, wandering these ruins looking for a man I don't know because you don't know yourself. Yeah, I should go home. <laughs> There's no point to this. Nothing will change. Oh, I can leave now. Okay, let's go home. Well, I'm gonna find Fluffy on the way down. Wow, he's, he's not looking too great. He can't see his eyes. It looks like he's sad. We're gonna find Fluffy on the way down. That's what's gonna happen. Right? We're leaving. Fluffy? <laughs> Who's crying? Is that the mom? Oh god, I can hear a mom crying. I can hear a woman crying. Why is there so much crying in this game? It sounded like a woman's voice. Could it be Fluffy's mother? She did come for him. That That's good. I don't think she did. She, I must have passed Fluffy by. The voice came from the clinic side. I'll go check it out. Oh, God. Oh, God. That might be Fluffy's mother, I heard. I, the clinic side. Clinic side. Clinic side. Are you upset about the kitty that died? I didn't like it either. Maybe you're in here. Uh-huh. What the heck, woman? Ah, oh, this room's finally open. Yes! Brilliant. Do I still have a bloody key? I still have a bloody key. I don't know what I'm going to do with the bloody key. I have yet to use that. Let's go inside. What is it? Oh, is this the morgue type area where all the people go when they're dead? Oh, who, who's that over there? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, it's, it's a shadow. It looks like a woman's shadow, though. Hey, who are you? You're talking to shadows, David. Oh, it's the mommy. Oh, that's mommy, isn't it? Oh, God. Oh, my mom. Oh, music's creepy. Goosebumps engaging. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What do you think of this? What do you, how are you? Comment down below. What do you think so far? <laughs> Davey, why do you abandon me? That, that, that's not... No, Mom, how can you be here? Oh, God. Oh, God. I hate hospitals. You're my family. Yet you abandon me? No, 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 no. You were sick, Mom. So, 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 so you left me? My own family couldn't stand me anymore? No! You're wrong! Oh, whoa, don't choke her! What are you doing, David? Who are you? My mom couldn't possibly be here. What are you pretending to be her? It hurts, Davy. Just like it did then. Let go! Why are you choking her out? 
Are you gonna try to kill me ag again? What? 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 It hurts so much. Davy. You tried to kill her? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, David, you don't have a very pretty voice. It's the not. I, I mean, I've heard prettier voices. Like Katy Perry, she's got a nice voice. Adele, she got a nice voice. David, no. Bad voice. Not. <laughs> oh, God damn it! What is with the loud noises in this game? Who are you? Why are you in my house? And what did you do with my husband? Answer me! The sheets is just gone. It's David. Mom, please stop. You keep saying things like that. Dad, Dad just went out, okay? Did you forget? <laughs> Shut up, intruder! Yeah, she's gone. She's too far gone. I don't know anyone like you! I'll call the police on you! Stop it. Don't tell me you're already going senile. Please, just take a rest for the day. I'm tired from work. Just tell me if I'm about. No! Damn it! Shut up! Keep your mouth shut! God, it's so loud. She's just breaking stuff, ain't she? Do you think I know you? Get out of here! Stop! I should probably close my window. People could probably hear me think I'm crazy. <laughs> what are you saying? Did I say something wrong? Just please tell me if I did something wrong. Are you teasing me? Because it's not funny. Please, Mom. Quiet! I'm not your mother. I don't know you. Get out. <sighs> Enough! Oh, 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 oh my god, are you actually choking her? You actually did try to kill her. Oh god, oh god, David, no, don't do it! David, David, I'm a murderer! Murderer, somebody, murderer! No, oh, wait, David, pa oh, Paul, Paul, hey, what are you doing? Hey, stop, let her go! Were you trying to kill her? David! Oh my god! Oh, here's the cops. Holy crap, Paul. And you're still hanging out with me after all that? It appears to be a brain tumor. It's putting much pressure on her brain. Sudden changes in behavior, violent action, memory loss can be signs of brain illness. It's not your fault. Don't be distraught. Whoa, that, 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 that was earlier. It's not your fault. Don't be distraught. I, we heard that earlier. In some cases, counseling to resolve friction in a family can uncover an illness. Maybe I shouldn't say this, but this kind of thing happens all the time. If we had noticed a little sooner. See? I told you this was all David! All David! This whole thing. Back to the topic of your mother. She appears to be very weak. We'll have to postpone the operation for now. We've hospitalized her for the time being, and her condition will influence our decision. Hopefully, it won't be long. Please come by to see her often. Even if she doesn't seem to know you, she is family. Hmm. No. We're not family anymore. Don't... Don't say that we are. If I hadn't stopped just like that, I would have... I would have never been forgiven for it. Uh, there really was hatred in me. And it's true, I've abandoned her in the hospital. She was my only family. My precious family who cared for me after my father left. And yet I... My wishes never come true. My dreams, love, even my family all go awry. I can't have anything that's not crooked. Told you he's the crooked man! Ha! <laughs> what have I been searching for? I don't know. I don't have to anymore. It's obvious now. There's only one way from the very beginning. Only one way what? Scene three. Central Hospital Fluffy. End. Save. Oh boy. I think we're in the last chapter here, guys. What's coming up now? Oh, I gotta burp. I gotta, I gotta make sure nothing scary happens, because if I gotta burp and scream at the same time, I'm gonna puke everywhere, man. Oh god. <laughs> okay, I think I got all- Oh, no. Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna try playing. Damn it! David hasn't answered a single call. What's he up to and where? I've just been exploring, guys. Paul, what do we do? I know we shouldn't have left David alone. Marianne, calm down and get a hold of yourself. How can I be calm about this, Paul? David's so worn out from the things with his mother and Shirley. <coughs> he's even suffering over old wounds. I was always scared for him. I was always scared he would do something there's no turning back from. I suggested moving to get his mind clear, but that didn't help and now did it. It wasn't a bad idea. But it was a mistake for me to pick that place. Why? Huh? Why? 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 Damn it, I'll call again. If he doesn't answer, we're calling the police. Oh, 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 what do you mean? Why, 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 why would the room, what? You knew about this, Paul? Paul? <laughs> Won't tell me ghost stories at a time like this, Paul. I'm always talking about how you see things and... Oh, huh? What? What? David? David? David, where are you? 
What? What are you talking about, Paul? Central Hospital. Oh, am I actually on the phone? Well, why are you way over there? Listen, I'm going there, so wait for me. Don't move as much of a muscle. D -d don't come. Please don't. Leave me alone. Oh, God, are you going to commit suicide, David? No, 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 no. Hey, David. Hey, hey, David. 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 I'll take about a day to get that place on my motorcycle. You better hurry, Paul. Marion, I'm gonna go see David. I'm going with you. David's my friend, too. I can't just ignore him at a time like this. All right, let's go. Gonna have to end this episode here, guys. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> David's gonna try and kill himself. He's got the gun. He's got the gun. He's got a gun. David's got a gun. And he can jump off a building. He can do all sorts of nasty things there. There's all sorts of injections he can give himself with the medicine. Oh my god, my voice is dying. I've been screaming too much. David's car, he's still gonna be here. Come on, Marion. It's so dark. Could stay, stay close behind me. Right. Am I gonna play as Paul? Am I Paul? I'm Paul. I'm Pauling it up. David! David! Oh, David! Uh oh. I can hear people running. Are those footsteps? They were from upstairs. Are you David? Why would he be running around? He wouldn't be running around. He'd be, be sitting there, really depressed, thinking about dying. He's not running around. He that that might that might be Fluffy running around, maybe. I bet you he's sitting on that chair looking at the bed where his mom would be. I bet you Yep, 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 yep. Who's there? What are you doing there? Uh, you David? David? Who are you? Whoa, sissy? A girl? What are you doing in this old place? Sissy? You hate sissies like me, don't you? Sissy! Uh, what? What are you doing here, sissy? But your friend is important to you, right? What the- what the heck are you? What's this about? Go see him. What the hell was that? <laughs> What does that even mean? Sissy! So I'm gonna find D now, right? And I'm gonna find Fluffy. I'm gonna find D, gonna find Fluffy. Uh, the, the... Right? Why else wouldn't I? Check in the cat room. Oh no, that's awful. You don't think David... Oh, come on. What do you think he would do something like that? He must have been some crazy dude. He might have. I don't know. I don't... I, I don't know what to think right now or what has been going on. I don't know if any of this is real. Because it all seems like it's a part of David's imagination. But Paul... Paul knows who Sissy is, or uh, I shouldn't say knows who Sissy is, but saw Sissy, right? Like, wouldn't that be a sign of her being real? I don't know, man. Maybe Sissy's a ghost. Maybe they're all this ghost. What? Oh, God. What are, what are you surprised about, Paul? Someone else? David? Who is this? Up here? It's D. Hey, who are you? What's up, D? This is... Yo! What is going on? What the hell? What are you doing? You're all alone. Oh, uh, well, don't hurt me. Hey, he's your friend, right? Go and save him. Tell him the truth. What the truth? What? I'm counting on you. What? What? Why is there so many people here? I don't get it. I don't get what's going on right now. Is this all about Paul? Is this whole game been about Paul? Is this Paul's imagination? What is going on? My voice is dying. I'm so sorry. I've been screaming so much because I've been trying to read and I've been freaking out and this is just, oh God, my voice, man. Oh God. There was a crooked man and he walked a crooked mile. This has got to be fluffy. A kid? Oh, <laughs> he's a kid wandering around here. Kid? Oh, it's fluffy. He found a crooked sentiment. It's expensive. I found a crooked style. And he bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse. Kid, what are you doing? And they all live together in a crooked little house. Hey, you listening to me? Then he had a crooked thought. What? Why is crookedness my lot? Why must I be crooked instead of being not? So the crooked man would cry, and he couldn't fathom why. He was sad all the time, and he sighed. And so he... So he what? David's waiting for you. Go see him. Hey! What? What's with him? Why do you know David? Did he meet him? Forget about it. Let's go, Marion. What is going- Oh, my head, man. My head. Marion, what's up? Stop it. You're teasing me? Don't you know this isn't the time for that? Oh, Marion? Is Paul seeing stuff, too? What do you mean, teasing you? Just who do you keep talking to? Oh, God. Everyone's going crazy! <laughs> Stop trying to spook me. I know well, there wouldn't be anyone here, so we just need to find David. No jokes. Well, it did- I remember now. Paul. It did say Paul was really into this- this other realm ghostly paranormal stuff, right? So that's it, huh? What, what's it? Marion, go and leave the hospital. Sorry for uh, trying to spook you. I, I'll find David, don't worry. Well, wait, I'm staying with you! Uh-oh. If anything's happened, I'll be putting us both in danger. Please just trust me. Alright. 
Please come back quickly. Right. Did you, did you wait for me, David? Oh god, do I gotta go on the roof or do I gotta go up one more? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm saving, I'm saving, I'm saving, I'm saving. I'm Paul, this doesn't feel good. This does not feel good at all. It does not, nope, no, not happy about what I'm feeling. David, what are you doing out there? Oh god, oh god, David, 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 David. Paul? Why, why are you here? I came to pick you up. I, I'll ask for a good explanation later. For now, you're coming home. Why does Paul see these things? Forget about me. Just leave me alone. Hey, hey Dave. Woo! Stay away! He's got the gun. Oh no no David no 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 David no 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 David you 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 David no no David don't do it don't do it don't do it don't do it. I'm I'm hopeless. I keep walking but I see nothing. I'll never ever be happy. I'm a crooked man. No matter what, that's what I'll be. There's only things I'll have. Oh oh what are you seeing? Oh God, that's a crooked man. To David David what's that's. We're gonna have to end this episode here, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. There might be one more episode left. Maybe two. I'm not sure. We're gonna see how the last part turns out. But let me tell you, it's a really interesting ending, and you guys are going to absolutely love watching it. So aside from that, I hope you're having a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next episode. Meow. Goodbye! Oh, God, no, no, no. What is gonna open? Oh, God. Oh, there he is! What are you eat eating the fetus? What? How's it going, everyone? My name is Swing Point, and this is another episode of The Crooked Man. I don't want to spoil too much for you, but I will tell you to make sure you are very worried for Fluffy this time.